Imagine looking up at the night sky as a kid, and being told that, space isn't for people like you. Now imagine proving the entire world wrong. On September 12, 1992, Dr. Mae Jemison did just that. She became the first African-American woman to travel into space, breaking not just Earth's atmosphere, but centuries of barriers and stereotypes. May wasn't born into privilege. She grew up in the 1960s, a time when both the space program and society weren't built for someone like her. But instead of backing down, she persevered and doubled down. She loved science, she loved dance, and she believed no dream was too big. Before space, May earned a medical degree from Cornell University and worked as a doctor in West Africa with the Peace Corps. She was literally saving lives on Earth before she set her sights on astronomy in the stars. But her true inspiration came from the TV show Star Trek. Watching Nichelle Nichols as Lieutenant Uhura, May saw something rare at the time. A black woman in the future, in space, making critical space decisions that mattered. And she thought, why not me? In 1987, May applied to NASA. Out of thousands of candidates, she was chosen. And five years later, aboard the Space Shuttle Endeavor, she spent eight days orbiting Earth as a mission specialist. She conducted experiments in life sciences, tested new technologies, and floated above the planet that once told her, you can't be a part of this. What makes her story even more powerful and inspiring is that she never wanted to be the first. She wanted to make sure she wasn't the last. Mae Jemison showed little girls, little boys, and especially young people of color that the stars belong to everyone. Today, she continues to inspire, leading projects to push human exploration in the outer space even further, toward Mars and beyond. May's journey is proof of this. Barriers aren't walls, they're just doors waiting for someone brave enough to push through. So the next time you look at the night sky, remember, because May dared to dream, the universe feels just a little bit closer.